Hey Scrappers, it's Vanessa here with my last process video for August using my Kit Club Overload Stash Kit. And this kit was using leftover bits and pieces from past Felicity Jane kits from when I was a subscriber. So if you actually missed where I showed everything that I put into each of the page kits that I created, just be sure to jump back to my August Kit Club Overload video. It's all going to be in the same playlist as this video and it'll allow you to see everything that I pulled and put in each page kit because I know the videos go very quickly and so sometimes I show everything and then other times I'm just doing what I'm doing here and just sort of creating. So if you have any questions about what's in any of the page kits, you can always see that video or ask me below and I would be happy to let you know. The first thing that I'm doing here is I'm taking this beautiful black and white diagonal stripe and I cut the center out of that paper because I love it so much and I'm going to mount this green piece of cardstock on top of that. And then I have cut this chevron sort of diagonal paper down and a, that's going to go on one it's not quite right in the middle it's sort of maybe three quarters toward the middle for that striped piece of paper that I've mounted on the green and the next thing that I'm doing here is I am just going to map my photo on that green polka dot paper and so my photo is going to go right there in the center of the page and there you just saw I did bring over and show you that I did fussy cut all of these black and white florals from a piece of the papers of one of the papers that were in this page kit and I have to say I am a huge fan of Felicity Jane and the florals that Felicity Jane puts in her kits I I absolutely love the florals they are just stunning and this black and white floral is no exception I absolutely love it and so because I find that I I'm using page kits that I've put together and I have fussy cut all these flowers and then I've taken and the embellishments I had put in the kit and they're just cut apart from the sticker sheets that used to come with Felicity Jane kit club and I find the pages come together super quickly I basically am doing again the three clusters of embellishments that I tend to gravitate to I do have that line of florals down the middle which gives some added interest as well but this came together extremely quickly because like I said I have already pulled everything together using that page kit I did go ahead and add some, I believe it was Heidi Swap um, Color Shine in Tinsel, I believe was the color. And I just did a few splatters in the background because it just kind of gives a little bit of interest to the background so it's not quite so plain. I also pulled out one of my Felicity Jane stamps. All the kits come with a stamp set and so I have plenty of Felicity Jane stamp sets that I can get some use out of and I often forget to pull them out so I grabbed one for this layout and I believe on the yellow tag I think that one said important notes or important moments or something along that line and then this other one I said I think it says love this day I believe you can probably see them a little bit better in the close-ups at the end so once I finished that stamping I did go ahead and just glue everything down just like you saw in the three clusters I have a flare badge up at the top to add a little dimension up there I have a little bow in the cluster that's there beside the title that you see me putting down right now and then on the other cluster I have a large vellum heart and some more florals and so my title is sunset stroll and this is just a picture that I took one night when we were taking the puppy for a walk and I have to say in Florida during the summers we don't do a whole lot of evening strolls or walking outside a whole lot just because it's so hot 
but as it turns sort of a little bit cooler and the humidity goes down we tend to like to try to get a walk in every once in a while when we can and so evening as the sun is setting is a beautiful time to just take a walk around the neighborhood and so that is what this picture is documenting and to finish the layout because because like I said this one came together extremely quickly I am just putting around the layout some of the silver little star sequins that came in one of the kits and I absolutely love these I think I have the gold ones and the silver ones and I think literally I could put them on every layout I absolutely love them I yeah I never want to run out of these I'm glad there's like a million of them so with that guys that is the end of this layout I hope you enjoyed and be sure to subscribe if you're not already and I will catch you guys on the next layout have a good day everybody bye bye